morning. It's Wednesday the 23rd of December and it's only two more sleeps till Christmas. Uh, so <laughs> we're going to do some an emolm of hand snatches uh, first today in the strength section. So that's going from the knee and you're aiming to land in a overhead squat, theoretically. And for some in practice. So you'll do two of them each minute for 10 minutes. Uh, some people will definitely just be doing a hang power snatch, which means it goes uh, from the knee to overhead and then maybe doing an overhead squat. Uh, we'll deal with that on a one uh, person basis at a time in the gym. Um, you can do this at home. You can do single arm hang snatches where you'll hold the weight at knee height, lead up with the elbow, full extension of your body, and drop over and see how close to landing in a squat you can get or in fact landing in a squat. It's actually, I wouldn't bother like adding weight or anything to this, like, I, I, like you know, use what you've got weight wise. Um, don't try and do both hands at the same time, just stick to one hand, okay? So don't try and hold the weight between one hand. Um, yeah, give it a go. If it's too easy because you've got like a really light weight and you've got a good overhead position, then you can maybe try and do like say five around. But work on technique rather than working on weight. And then for the cardio section, uh, this will work for everybody regardless if you're in the gym or at home. It's going to be five rounds for time of 25 Russian swings, 20 squat thrusts. So remember, on your hands and your toes, jumping your feet in. So start in a plank position, jump your feet in, jump your feet out. One, jump your feet in, jump your feet out. Two. Uh, 15 push press, that's from the shoulder to overhead. Two weights at a time if you can, if not, if you've only got one, just one weight and keep switching hands. And then 10 pike setups. Go fast. That's it. Bye.